very much for the introduction and it's an honor for me to share our um, research results here and yes um hello my name is Yuta Chiyama from Kobe University Japan and my presentation title is uh, green infrastructure management during the COVID-19 pandemic, local perception and expectation on urban forest. And this is a photo taken in the pandemic period in Japan. Uh, people are still going out and enjoying the nature. And it seems um, the attraction of nature became stronger or especially for the forest visitors these days. And in the green infrastructure management, we need to do it as a kind of, uh, with the inclusive method to make it more sustainable. And in that management, we need to consider the local perception and expectation on urban forest to involve the broad stakeholder related to the management. The contents of my presentation is first background visiting. It's about the existing study of uh, forest visiting during pandemic and, and also um, we will share the result of preliminary analysis. And lastly, he, we, I would like to show some discussion point, which is about needs of inclusive management of citizens with different perception. And this is our previously published paper, and I'm happy to share this paper if you are interested. And existing studies. There are a lot of uh, existing studies which are focusing on the visiting green areas during the pandemic. And they tended to focus on changes on number of visitors before and after the pandemic. And also they're doing correlation analysis between individual attributes of the citizen and green area visit. Um, but there are limited analysis on the impact of surrounding environments, such as this pattern of residential places. So we, we conducted analysis on the impact of surrounding environment on the forest visit. And these are the variables surveyed in this research. The first, socioeconomic attributes. And there are kind of um, basic attributes, including gender, age, on your household income, number of children in the household. And we also included environmental factors, which is zip code district data. And this, these are the size of the, the areas of that district and also the ratio of uh, these categories. And we asked the respondents whether they visited peri urban forest run and mountain in the emergency declaration period. The last question is about changes of awareness on the function of forest. This is a map which we used in this study. This is high resolution map of land use pattern in study site. The study site is located in the central part of Japan here. And it has Nagoya city, which is uh, one of the biggest city in Japan. And this is the information of online survey we conducted. Survey period is from July 31st to August 1st in 2020, and survey site is Aichi Prefecture. The number of respondents is 1,244. 
uh, including force visitors, the number is 212. Result. The first result is about reasons for visiting forest. As you can see in this figure, uh, they tended to answer that the reason is to feel relaxed in the forest. And more than 40% of respondents answered to uh, chose this reason. So that means the, the reason is related more on the mental or spiritual aspect of forest. And the second result is about awareness on the function of forest land. Uh, this figure shows the answer of before and after the before and after the emergency period. And the blue bar shows the answer of forest visitor and red bar shows non a uh, forest visitors. And this graph shows that the they, they are more aware on the mental and the physical acquisition space for the forest run. And after the emergency period, their awareness became strengthened or more stronger even before the uh, pandemic uh, emergency period. So it means um, before the forest visitor, they are more uh, relatively more aware on the mental or spiritual aspect of forest function and that became strengthened after the after experiencing the emergency period. And the last result is about environmental factors and forest visit. These two tables shows that the forest visitor tended to live in relatively in rural areas with higher ratios of forest land. These are the result of T test and we compared the uh, uh, average ratio of forest run of residential area of forest visitor and non forest visitors in the left table. And it shows the, the ratio of forest land of residential area of forest visitor is significantly higher. And the right table shows the size of the residential district is significantly larger uh, in the case of forest visitors. So that means they tend to live in the rural areas. This map shows the distribution of forest visitors and non-forest visitors. The green shows the distribution of forest visitors. And as you can see in this picture, uh, figure, this is a central area of, of the largest city in this prefecture. And people, respondents who are living in this central area, they didn't visit forest or mountainous areas in the pandemic area. In discussion. I would like to share these two discussion points. One is the forest visitors are more aware of forest function in mental health care. And the second one is surrounding environment influences forest visit. These points are still need to be verified in more large scale research or uh, research in different region or countries. But um, these are the kind of working hypotheses. 
in the future, it's uh, as for the future research, we are now doing a research on identifying segment or profile for policy interventions uh, using data of citizen socioeconomic attributes and environmental factors. And specifically, now we are doing a categorization of citizen to find the effective communication method for individual groups to involve them in management processes. Uh, thank you for your attention and this is